Hey, this is Thrack. Uh, I wanted to address uh, Mel Gibson and his Viking project. He's working on a Viking movie. He's working on it with DiCaprio. I want to address Mel Gibson as well if he gets to see this. So hello there, uh, if you ever do get to see it. Uh, basically, I want to say we support you. Basically, no one has ever, ever produced a good Viking film to date. I mean, you look historically, no. They did uh, The Vikings with Ernest Borgnine and Kirk Douglas. Very, very good movie. But, I mean, it was still limited to the uh, technology of Hollywood at the time. They didn't do all the research. They just had bits and tidbits and pieces from the sagas. Uh, if you see uh, 13th Warrior, excellent film adapted from Michael Crichton. As I said, Michael Crichton had an excellent storyline based on Beowulf. He was trying to do a realistic Beowulf called Eaters of the Dead. The movie was well done except for the fact that the fight scenes, I think, lacked in realism. They were very simplistic. They just seemed kind of brutal and unskilled. And also, the costumes. They had people in gladiator armor. They had later century armor from around the 15th, 16th century that the king was wearing. Uh, not too good. And then another example, we have Pathfinder with the Native Americans. I don't know how they did on the Native Americans, but all I can say is the Vikings did everything but say exterminate, like the Daleks from Doctor Who. Basically, I guess what I'm saying on the uh, movies that they've done is that they've given a really terrible view of the actual Scandinavian culture and history. And I think Mel Gibson's just the man who could actually portray it correctly. He's done, I mean, he's done uh, The Passion of Christ. Some people didn't like that movie, but I think he did an excellent job in a historical way. Uh, if you look at Apocalypto, it was an excellent movie. Very, very well done. I mean, and with the kind of detail he put into that, I think he could do an excellent Viking film and make it historically accurate and actually do something that would be epic. And the reason why I believe this film would be epic is because he's going to actually take things into consideration like actual sagas, Scandinavian history, social, social interaction, uh, the people as actual people, not as machines or killers or some weird stereotype that you know, has been portrayed to us for all these years. The frogging at the mouth berserker who has no brains. You know, stuff like that. And them doing mushrooms or something to attack somebody. Uh, basically, that wasn't exactly what it was like. I would like to see the actual fighting in the movie to actually show Skjallborg, like shield walls, uh, actual real fighting, the weaponry used correctly. I'm sure he's the man that could do that. And also, where I think he's just the man to do it is in Lethal Weapon, one of my favorite movies when I was younger, uh, the last fight scene between the Special Forces, you know, him and uh, the other Special Forces guy, was choreographed by one of the Gracies. It is actually something very unique for its time because it looked like something from the UFC that hadn't even been seen or heard of yet. So I think he would have all the concepts and ideas he would need to make this come about in this way. And honestly, if he contacts me in any help or in any way that we can give him our support, we shall gladly give it to him. I want to see this movie come about. I think it's going to be a big turn in culture towards the uh, Viking uh, concept and idea.